Back in the day, the blacks stayed in their own neighborhoods and the whites stayed in their own neighborhoods. Same thing with the Irish, the Italians, the Jews, and the Polish. In South Philadelphia, Second Street was Irish, Polish. The Jewish community was 7th Street, 6th Street, 5th Street. The Italian community was going west after 9th Street, okay? Schuylkill, Fairmount, Irish, Irish. And you didn't go out of your neighborhood at that time. If you were going from one neighborhood to another neighborhood and they didn't know you, hey, what are you doing here? You don't belong here. Yeah, I'm coming to see my aunt. Well, what's her name? Where she live? All right, you were accepted. And a lot of that had to do with the Catholic parishes. If you were in St. Monica's, you could not go to St. Thomas's. You had to support that parish. That was your neighborhood. The Italians at that time, me and my sister, we were Jewish. Uh, I was raised Catholic, so was my sister. But my father, who was never around, you know, and was disowned by his family because he is a Jewish racketeer, uh, we were sort of, it was prejudice back then. I mean, they, they loved, but they would say, Gistas on of Matza Christ, which means this is the killer of Christ, you know, and, and we were not allowed to open our mouths, and my other cousins would be laughing and singing and dancing. We had to be very reserved.